So there's my best friend right there, guys. She found herself a toy. And she's pretty content and occupied and happy. She's having a good time. Okay, let's bring you back over here. The first thing I want to do is say how lucky I am for all of you guys that are in my life. If you're a friend of mine on Facebook, if you're a friend of mine from eBay, or one of my subscribers on YouTube, I appreciate you all, and I'm very grateful to have you as friends and have you in my life. That being said, I'm gonna show you two gifts here that I received from two very kind people, and um, I'm very happy about it. We're gonna start off first with this package. This is from a friend of mine named Joey. He runs a business on eBay called Wilderness Kydex. I will put his eBay store down below, the link to his store down below. He's an excellent craftsman. He's a great guy. His prices are affordable and his sheaths are top notch. Um, it's the only Kydex I've known. I started off as a customer of his and we just developed a relationship on eBay. I contacted the seller, we talked. I found out more about him. He's a big knife guy, guys. Uh, if you need a sheath for a knife, he probably owns it. He owns hundreds of knives. He probably has it and can make you a top-notch, affordable sheath. They're excellent. I've shown his videos before, but I do plan to do a reboot of his videos here um, coming up pretty soon. And on the Horizon Forum, for those of you guys who own the SCHF, SCH Shrade, SCHF Shrade 9, um, he's got a Kydex sheath for that that's upcoming, so keep an eye out for a video on that. What I got from Joey is some special gifts. Make sure we're in frame here. First of all, um, what I initially requested was the Mora 510 Kydex sheath. I love the Mora 510. I've given a couple away and I have one. I just didn't have a Kydex for it. And a knife without a wilderness Kydex sheath is incomplete to me. So I asked him if he could make me one. Not only did he make me one, he sent it to me as a gift. And that is outstanding. All of his sheaths are, the way I wear them, are upside down neck hangs. They come with the paracord here. So that's the 510. You can see the outline of the 510 right there. Next one he sent me, just out of the kindness of his heart, I didn't even ask him. He knows I own a Condor Kephart. Well, Condor sheaths are great. They're not Wilderness Kydex sheaths. Check that out, guys, if you can see it. I'm sorry, I don't have my knives out with me now. I just wanted to knock this unboxing out or this show you the gifts that I got. But we'll, we'll show these all coming up soon. You see the drain hole right there? One of the things I really love about his sheets is the way that they come up on the handle. And because they come up on the handle, they almost work as a vacuum and suck the sheets, suck the knives right in. The retention is outstanding. So this was a gift just out of nowhere, out of the blue. Hey, I also made you a Condor Kephart sheath. So that's going to turn my Condor Kephart into a neck knife. And then finally, once again, out of the kindness of his heart, you guys might have saw in another video, he just went and sent me a more a clipper that I didn't own with his Kydex sheath. Well, he did it again. This time he included the Mora 711, which is a knife that I looked at previously, but I never picked up, and it's great. I love the handle on this thing, a nice big fat handle to grab onto. Um, standard Mora blade, Scandi grind, it's beautiful. And I'll be showing this in some upcoming videos. 
and the sheath for it. Just great. Look at that. He's got it all set up for my upside down neck hang, for my upside down neck knife. So outstanding, Joey. Thank you so very much. Once again, if you can, please go check out Wilderness Kydex on eBay. His information is going to be below. Um, you could even just contact Seller and say hi. Say, how you doing? Um, I saw your stuff on Dave's channel, on High Carbon Steel Love's channel. He just bought a new house. Um, he's getting settled in, and he's just getting back into his Kydex work. And once again, he's probably got the knife you're going to want a sheath for, and if he doesn't have it, he'll get you all taken care of. He'll direct you from there. So thank you so much, Joey. Let's get to our other box here, or our other package. Our other package, interestingly enough, is from England. I've never gotten a package from England before, so this was outstanding. I ripped it right here a little bit, but I'm going to cherish this packaging as much as the gift that was in it. You see Royal Mail right there? I just thought it was pretty cool. There was my address in USA on the bottom. And then on the back here, um, customs declaration. So this is a gift from a Facebook friend of mine named Jason Bridges. And Jason is a great guy. He said that I helped him with some sharpening videos that I did. You guys might have saw some sharpening videos I did uh, previously. And he showed some proof on Facebook of how I helped him. This guy actually has a picture, which is a very cool picture. He's shaving his face with an axe. Now, I get my knife shaving sharp, but I've never taken a knife or an axe to my face and shaved my face with, a, with one of those. This guy actually does it, and he has photo proof on there, and it's a really cool picture. Anyway, he wanted to thank me for helping him with um, some sharpening. He had a few videos listed that I helped him with, and I was touched just to be able to help him. Out of the blue, he said, what's your address? I want to send you something. And what he sent me was, once again, one of my favorite knives, the Mora 510. Now, let me read to you his note that he sent me. His note right here. It says, Dear David, please find enclosed a Mora knife. At first look, here's our first look, it's a Mora 510. But please look on the blade, the left side. It was one of the first black 510s ever made and that was done, I believe, for Ray Mears Bush Lore Shop. Many thanks, Jason. So we're actually going to check that out. As he said in his note, at first look, it's a Mora 510. Oh, there it is, right there. I hope you guys can see that okay. It says Mora 510 Black, first production run by www.hkgt.de. And I saw a couple guys have these on YouTube, and I checked out Ray Mears store a couple times, and I saw that, and they all had this stamp on the back, this Mora 510 black stamp on the back. I thought they were really cool. I just never picked up one because it was overseas, and his it was across the pond, and his um, customer base was mainly in Europe, and it's not cheap to send stuff back and forth from Europe to Western New York, United States. So this is a tremendous gift. And uh, Jason, I thank you very much. I'm very appreciative for it. Not only is it a Mora 510, it's that Ray Mears Mora 510, which I never thought that I would get my hands on. So I'm gonna cherish this blade. I'm gonna cherish the packaging because it was my first not only my first gift ever from England, but my first package ever from England. So that's about it. I just wanted to express my appreciation. 
I also want to express my appreciation for everybody out there once again that I'm friends. I love all of my friends. I love all of my subscribers, especially my best friend right there looking for something else to play with. So I appreciate it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We're going to do videos and show more of this stuff um, down the line here. And these gifts are going to pop up. You're going to see them. If you can please, I will put links to each of them, to Joey's Wilderness Kydex page. And I'm kind of new at this, so I don't know how Facebook uh, addresses or links work. I'll try to link his page. But if it's not there and you're on Facebook, uh, just do a search for Jason Bridges or go to my channel, which is the same as my YouTube channel, High Carbon Steel Love. Search my friends. You'll find Jason Bridges and um, request a friendship from him or whatever we do on Facebook. Thank you so much, guys. We'll talk to you again down the road. Bye-bye.